okay, okay, okay. All right, I'm freaking out right now. I'm freaking out. Okay, I just seen a video. I just seen a video from WCC, and I, it's Blaster Blade. It's Blaster Blade. I just said this in my video recently. I just also Ezel stuff's been revealed. Ezel stuff's been like I'm so. Oh my god, my, dude, dude, he's back. <laughs> I can't believe he's actually back. I didn't think he would. I didn't think that dude. Do... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what's this? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, what is this? Okay, I need to calm down. But I'm probably gonna slap this at the beginning of like my video after I've like calmed my shit down and I can like get my thoughts together. Okay, I'll see you guys in the proper video, which is gonna be soon. Okay, guys, we have stuff to talk about today. Um, I know there's been a few things revealed. I'm still not too sure about everything yet. But there's two things that I saw, like, literally minutes ago that I just want to make a video for instantly. Now, we're going to start with the Ezel reveals for the uh, V-Clan collection, uh, which is coming uh, later this year. I think it's, like, a couple of months or something. Um, March, is it, for English? Right. Get your get get your stuff together. <laughs> get your stuff together, right? So we're going to start with the Ezel stuff now. I haven't read these yet, so this is legit my initial reaction. So we'll just go with it, okay? Right. So the grade one, uh, Sacred Twin Beast White Lion, um, Auto Van or Rear. When this unit attack, uh, when this unit attack or the the attack that this unit boost uh, hits a Vanguard. You can look at the top six cards of your deck. Choose up to two grade three cards of Ezel in their different card names. Reveal them, put them into your hand, and then shuffle your deck. Uh, if you put two cards into your hand, choose a card from your hand and put it into your soul. Wow, interesting. Well, that synergizes uh, well with the uh, Platinum Ezel at least, so that's cool. Um, are we going to be pulling like a heavy like grade three Ezel build? I wonder with this. It seems like it. Um, that's interesting though, and it's Van and Rear as well, so it's uh, yeah, you can use that across the game, which is cool. So not too bad. Uh, we'll see where this leads though, because we have the Grade Two um, Knight of Passion Bagdemagus. Uh, good old Bagdemagus is back. So uh, continuous regard uh, during your turn. Uh, this unit gets five thousand power for each Grade Three with Ezel in its different card name in your soul. Okay, that's interesting. Um, and then continuous regard, if your soul has two or more grade three cards, uh, when this unit would attack, it battles all of your opponent's units in a column. Okay, so uh, so he just nukes everything in front of him, basically. Um, well, when he attacks, at least. So, huh. Okay. Well, I like the fact that he gets like the power as well, because um, obviously Bagdemagus used to be the old uh, 12k uh, beat stick for Ezel back then. So it is cool that he's got like Ezel synergies and he gets like b big buff power essentially the more you have in the soul. So that's pretty cool. Um, so he's a 9k. So if you get like three Ezels into the soul, um, then he'll be a 24 on his own, which is pretty good. So uh, yeah, okay. So um, yeah, that, that, that's, that's cool. That's cool. All right. Let's check the big guy himself. <laughs> okay. Oh my God, he's got two skills. Both of them are Vanguard. All right. So, um, right. Act Vanguard Circle. Once per turn. Cost. Uh, put a grade three card with Ezel in its card name uh, from your hand into your soul. Oh, okay. So that um, that works with the Bagdemagus then. Uh, choose all of the grade three cards with Ezel in their card names, not named Salvation Lion Grand Ezel Scissors in your soul. And this unit gets... What?! It gets all of their abilities until the end of turn. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Okay. My brain. Um, I need to read the second skill. Act Vanguard Circle. Once per turn. If, you're, if your opponent's Vanguard is grade 3 or greater, and your soul has two or more grade 3 cards, uh, cost Counter Blast 1. Until end of turn, this unit gets Drive plus 1, and your opponent cannot activate Vanguard Auto abilities. Okay. Strange. Uh, unlock all of your locked cards. Okay, well, <laughs> that bit I expect at least. Um, it's kind of tacked on the end, but uh, 
okay, it's a Link Joker out, I guess. But my God, what is that first skill? I didn't think that was a thing. Um, I didn't think it would. Uh, it takes all the abilities of the Ezels in your soul. So from Blonde Ezel, it's going to get the... Um, this unit gets all of their abilities until end of turn. So you're going to get the extra attack skill from Blonde Ezel. Uh, you'll have the, um, you're going to have the option to do the uh, Raven skill uh, for Counter Blast for 15 and a crit with no Sentinels. Um, and then you'll have uh, Platina's ability as well, which is to, uh, you know, change your uh, drive checks that turn uh, and then call stuff from the top of the deck. Oh my god, it's like a a mega fusion. It's like they've legit fused all of the Ezels together to make this massive grand Ezel scissors like wow 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 that's crazy like <laughs> I need to uh I need to let that sink in um and yeah the second skill uh your soul has two or more grade threes and your your opponent's van needs to be greater or greater uh you get your counter blast to get a drive check uh, and your opponent cannot activate auto abilities. You see, the only thing that comes to my mind with that is like Gurgwit, you know, like the the, the um, defensive skill where you can like call. Um, what else is auto? Oh, wait. Um, your opponent can activate Vanguard or oh, Vanguard auto abilities, right? Okay. So they can still perfect guard this. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'd have to like look more into that. I don't know what terms of like auto abilities to run a vanguard would like stop um like would be an issue the, like the, the, only, the only thing that came to my mind was gurgwit but yeah um and of course unlocking your units as well um i expected that at much but man <laughs> my brain my brain dude um that surprised me that really surprised me um wow okay uh well bag demagus and the uh, white line where um my, <laughs> those those I soaked in easier, but the Grand Ezel Scissors, dude, like what is this deck? Like I, I mean, I got what I asked for. I asked for a more interesting Ezel build, and I mean, this is about as interesting as you're going to get, I think. So <laughs> why not just merge all of the Ezels together in this one card? And uh, yeah, oh, what's the Grade Three count of this deck going to be? Like, oh my god, like. We need to run the superior ride, surely, and then it's like, you know, what's what do we do in terms of like the ratios of this? I I, I don't know. Like, this is this is going to be a thinker. All right, well, that's that. So now we have the other thing that I freaked out about, which was um, uh, <laughs> blaster blade, blaster blade got revealed for uh, overdress. Um, oh god, I can only imagine. Um, oh, there's. You know how I said in like my recent video how I feel like people are are accepting of encounter cards. Um, I was kind of thinking to myself, oh well, there's no chance we're going to get it this early, right? Because you know, you know, Keter and Dragon Empire already got one last year, so then it's like, what do they do this year? Turns out they're going to burn my bank account. That's what they're going to do this year. So um, anyway, we'll start with Blaster Blade. So I have again, I haven't read this either. So right. <laughs> I need to calm down, dude. I need to calm down. Okay. So, auto. When this unit is placed on Vanguard Circle, cost, counter blast one. Choose when your opponent's regards and retire it. Uh, if you did not retire, draw a card. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I, I like that. That That's nice. So you can retire something or you get the draw if you don't have anything. That, that I like that one. Okay. Um, auto. When this unit is placed on regard Circle, cost. Uh, counter blast one. Choose your own opponent's grade two or greater regards, and retire it. All right. Well, pretty similar to its old ability. Um, yeah. I mean, that seems fine. Uh, it's retire. Um, I can actually see this being used in other builds as well because it's just a very simple on place CB retire a grade two or greater. Yeah, and it doesn't have to be the front row either. It just um. Just retire a grid to a greater regard and uh yeah, pop it. So Oh my god, yeah, that's that's decent. I like it. It's very simple, it's it's just consistency with a draw if you don't retire when you ride him. Um Okay. 
Okay, so interesting. Um, okay, so we had one other thing which I kind of freaked out about. Uh, where's the picture? Um, dude, what's this? What is this? Majesty Lord Blaster, Phantom Blaster Overlord, and Dragonic Overlord the End. Like, I didn't think they'd go this far, dude. I didn't think they'd go this far. Like, I mean, there it is. There's the the other Overlord name that we should have expected. Because uh, I know that Nahalem, uh, the grade two that you ride, usually in Overlord in the ride line, uh, it mentioned like Overlord Vanguard, like Overlord in its card names. I'm like, oh, they're setting up like other Overlords in the future, definitely. And then it's like, well, there it is. That's you're going to go Overlord at the end. So there's your other Overlord. So, uh... <laughs> oh, oh, what is this? What is this? Um, dude, my. I need to save my money this year. Like, I need to, like, not spend anything at all. Like, set five, I'm just going to go ham with. Like, this set is... Oh, it's going to burn my bank account so much. <laughs> yeah, and then we also other reveals. So there's, like, um, Nemain is coming back as well. Uh, hopefully they don't, you know, break her again, like in V-Series. Um, I think that's Burning Horn Dragon, I think, for Overlord. That was the older... 12k attacker for Overlord back then. Um, yeah, they seems to have these like 10 year anniversary stamps on them as well. I have to like double check that. Uh, 10th Triple R. I'm not too sure what this is. Yeah, this is like a very vague reaction, guys. Um, like I just saw this like minutes ago and I'm freaking out right now. So yeah, I haven't checked this like other stuff, like this new stuff uh, with these like unit stuff. Like I don't know what this is. Oh my god. Right. I'm going to end the video here and try put something together because you've got my initial reaction. Um, I can only imagine the uh, the debates in the community right now with this. Um, but just to give you my senses, I'm always happy to see, you know, uh, <laughs> I'm always happy to see respect for like the old stuff because this, this is like my territory in terms of like the thing I love in Vanguard. And I do love the new units, don't get me wrong. Like I love Hexarob, I love Bastion, you know. I, I'm always open to new stuff, but listen, I'm a sucker for nostalgia. I'll just say it. I'm a sucker for nostalgia. It grabs me, but I'm always just going to look at this as like a happy thing. Like I'm not going to be turning this into any sort of negativity because that's just not who I am. Like I look at this stuff and I can't help but get emotional about this. Like this is just super mega hype for me. I'm so happy. Um, I... I think what it was is that I accepted the idea that they probably wouldn't touch, like, Blaster Blade or anything like this until, like, another year or so. So the fact that it's now here and now completely surprised me. So, yeah, like, I was open for this to, like, take longer, but they're just doing it. And not only that, but they're bringing back MLB, uh, Phantom Blaster Overlord, and Dragonic Overlord at the end as well. 2022 is looking bright, isn't it? <laughs> my 2022 is looking great um but yeah I i'll stop now because i'm just gonna keep blabbing and blabbing so i hope you guys liked my initial reaction to this i, I don't usually do these uh, reactions uh, that often but here it is uh yeah i'm gonna soak this information in some more um maybe do some posts on like the community tab or facebook or whatever but yeah i wanted to get the Ezel stuff and the blast Bird reveal like out there just so you guys can know that i am really happy and mega hyped for this like oh my god i freaked out when i saw this i saw the thumbnail from wcc and i was like i just i broke <laughs> i just broke um but yeah anyway i'll stop now okay i'm stopping the video now okay right i'll see you guys in the next one this is guardian 25 signing out oh my god right